Welcome back. Carrie joins me from the DeYoung Family Zoo with Carrie and Bud, your namesakes here. <laughs> well, you were talking a little bit about these tortoises. Tell us something. So these are Russian tortoises. And Carrie, the female, is larger if you look at the two of yeah. them. So the females grow a little bit bigger so that they can house the eggs. This is fully grown. They don't get any bigger than this. The other way to tell a male from a female is by looking at the back. The males have a longer tail than the females do. He's tucking his tail up in there. Okay. See, she's got a short little tail and yeah. his tail tucks it. Oh, wow. So that's how you can tell the difference between males and females. But this is all the bigger they get. Mm -hmm. And they are mostly like... Uh, leafy, lettucey type eaters. Not okay. too many vegetables, not too many fruits, but um, they're very sensitive, so they can actually feel when you're touching them and picking them up. Um, it's just like if you rub on the top of your fingernails. Mm -hmm. Which is something I didn't know. I didn't know that turtles or tortoises could feel yeah. that. But. And these are tortoises, so a lot of mm -hmm. people look at them and think they're turtles, but the main thing between tortoises and turtles is, see, these guys don't have webbed feet like a turtle yeah. does, because they oh. don't swim in the water. They will go in the water and submerge themselves, but they don't swim like a turtle does. And these guys are kind of famous around the area, huh? Some racing they do? Yeah, we actually do turtle tortoise races with these two, and that's how they ended up getting named Bud and Carrie, because we're a little competitive. So um, <laughs> the school kids named them after us, and we bring them with us when we go out to visit the schools. or And when we do our reptile talks at the zoo, we actually have an area that we put these two down, and they do race each other, because... A lot, they are slow because they're tortoises, <laughs> but they actually can move pretty fast, as you can see. Especially yeah, they're going. Carrie's on the move. They're at it. And you guys have some other exciting stuff going on at the zoo. Yes, we're very excited. We now have a one-week-old baby spider monkey that was oh. born at the zoo. We're very excited. The baby's doing great with its mom, Gracie, and Gunner is the dad. Um, they are in their indoor habitat right now for the winter, and the baby was born last Monday, so we're very excited. Oh, my excited. gosh, I bet it's the cutest thing out there. Oh, it's got the biggest eyes, and then they have those long prehensile tails, so yeah. it's just, it's so cute. You guys, we'll have to see that once you guys open back Yeah, up well, she'll come visit in a month or so. We'll probably bring her out to visit. So. Oh, awesome. And our baby kangaroo is getting very big, starting <laughs> to poke its head out of the pouch. So, yes, there are lots of babies. Too many Even though it's winter time, we still have some new additions coming, so we're pretty excited. We're looking forward to that. Thank you for coming in this morning. Yeah. We'll be right back.